I love this cover. <laughs> the Book of Candle Magic by Madame Pamita. And, like, for someone who likes candle magic, I should have finished this book a lot sooner and um, filmed this video a lot sooner. And depending on when I schedule this video, this will come out a lot later. <laughs> uh, okay, candle spell secrets to change your life. So, and like you got that gold, like you got like the gold and silver foil type effect. It's, it's more seen on like the silver. Um, the gold is a little more matted, but, and it is hard, um, cover, so you do have that. So, uh, she states in the introduction that this book is a complete guide to candle magic and will not only help you understand the basic principles so that you can get started doing a spell today, but it will also help you deepen and enrich your work. Jump in and try some simple spell work and I'm sure you'll fall in love with the magic of the flame just as I have. So, it is a pretty decent, like amount of pages like you're looking like in the index you're going into the, the 300s so um you are getting a good chunk of information from her so like the direct like the directions um spiral of manifestation so like like how it would go so like east idea south action sp west spirit north manifestation and then like begin again so it's just a constant circle and like she goes like through that magical code of ethics um so like questions to uh, like ask yourself like maybe like I maybe it's because like I haven't like fully jumped in, jumped in to like every single pos like possible book that's out there but um I don't like you don't really see like books that are like what are your ethics think about it and eh, what like what are your answers to these questions um, cause like I think it's, um, important to ask yourself that, um, she then goes into like making an altar, charging a candle, um, and like she has like this little charge, candle charging experiment, like how to do it, um, yourself, basics of a candle spell, you got a basic candle spell. So, like, anytime you see, like, a title in between these, you know it's some sort of, like, spell or ritual or something. Uh, spell safety, types of candles. You do get some visuals. Um, figure candles floating. Color magic. So, you do get, like, key associations to the basic, um colors so like like overall colors like orange pink um purple so like not like light yellow dark yellow um other types of colors um what's in your magical toolkit so like matches glass jars snuffers and um a few other things um like so and then she goes into like kind of like spells so, so like writing a petition paper um and gives you like a few examples and then like 
spoken so like if you don't want to like write it down um symbols and seals simple seals and sigils so like if you don't like if you want to have a picture of something like it'd be a doodle so like if you don't want words and so you can have a, some sort of symbol and have like magical attachment to it um dressing a candle um inscribing and decorating so like there's that um working with the faces of the moon um planets time time of day so uh that can um help you out there um making magic candles is a chapter so like rolling beeswax candles making your own dipped taper and so just like how to make a candle your own um so and like working with she goes into a chapter of like the figure candles so like the symbolism of like the figures so like if you have an angel candle or if you have a cat candle um goes into numbers so like um numer numerology and um candle spells um multi candle spells multi day spells Um, like, dividing a taper candle with, like, pins to, like, this is day one, two, three, or whatever. Uh, okay. Like, if you're working with, um like layout of like if you have like candles layout like a shape of it <clears throat> like if you have it in a certain triangle or like a cross or something mm -hmm. um oil lamps mason jar oil lamp Honey jars, uh, candle readings, so like wax readings, um, tunneling if a uh, glass holder or tray breaks or explodes, flame reading, so like different ways to read the candle. Um, so. So like uh, she includes like when you're done with like the candle or the spell what do you do so um, like with the remains the spell work so it's category like um, sectioned off um, creating a grimoire um, so like objective of spell start and end ingredients used um, so like basically like from start to finish of the spell or ritual so like you can go back of what worked what didn't so um and then the appendix you get like um so first appendix you get um list of magical herbs so like um what topic and it'll give you a list of herbs so like um, business success, um, alfalfa, allspice, um, Irish moss, and a few others, uh, gossip ending, chia seed, clove, a few others, so you get, um, that, uh, gems, same thing, attracting, list of crystals, authority, list of crystals, uh, Magical shells, so attraction, authority, banishing, same as the others. 
magical talismans. So you get a few different, um, there's a few other um, appendixes that are like, so um, there's like five appendixes that are all like that. Um, and you get a glossary as well, a bibliography, about four pages, pr pretty decent. Yeah, pretty decent looking. Um, might have to look into a few of these myself if I haven't already. Um, but I love this book. It is a good book to have as, um, like this and, um, Candle Magic by Lady Passion. I'm, I'm looking at it right now. Like I have a few Candle Magic books on my shelf and I'm looking at them right now. Um, but like this and Candle Magic by Lady Passion, um, are two really great books. Like, yeah, these, um, this one and the Candle Magic book are two re re relatively recent releases in the past few year, few years. Um, the other ones I'm looking at uh, are like years before this one, these ones, but, um, for recent reads, these two are really good for having that connection to, obviously this one is candle, like start to finish candle. The candle magic has like also, um, by Lady Passion, um, some fire information as well. Um, so like she has a few bits of other information there as well. Um, if I remember, I'll, I'm not even going to attempt to know which corner. I'll attempt to either put it, my review of the Candle Magic book, either in the description or um, above. Um, figure the cards out. <laughs> um, but it is, this is a really great book for the candle magic person in your life, or if that's you, if you haven't gotten your hands on this already, <laughs> or if you're just starting out, this is a great source of like a lot. You do get a lot of information in here, and you do get like the spells and rituals, but it is a good book. In my, like, in my opinion, it is a good book to have. So, yeah. The book of Candle Magic. Happy readings.